my name is Nathan Taylor, otherwise known as Sockmetician, and this is a double knitting tutorial. In this one I'm going to show you how to work the right leaning double decrease. Uh, and for that I need to rearrange my next three pairs of stitches from knit purl, knit purl, knit purl, to knit, 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 purl, purl, purl. And to do that I insert the tip of my right needle into the front of the first, third and fifth stitches, leaving out second and fourth ones entirely. Slide the left needle out of all five stitches and the second and fourth stitches pop free at the back. Quickly slide the needle back into them before they have a chance to go anywhere and then slip the three knit stitches purlwise back onto the left needle. Then uh, for the right leading double decrease, it's a knit three together on the front of the fabric. I'm using my yarn A, but you could just as easily use yarn B. Knit those three together, bring the yarns together to the front of the work, and then the matched decrease for the knit three together is a slip, slip, slip purl, and that's done like this. Slip one stitch knitwise, slip a second stitch knitwise, slip a third stitch knitwise, slip them all back purlwise to the left hand needle and then using yarn B purl all three together through the back legs which means going round the back like that coming through all stitches towards you purling them together and then finishing off by taking the yarn together to the back of the work that's uh, got a right leaning decrease there on the front and it looks like it leans to the left on the back meaning both of them are leaning in the same direction the right leaning double decrease in double knitting